Hello, all my fit friends, and welcome back. It is workout four of week four. It's our final stretching session together. Can you believe it? It's a beautiful day out here. I can smell the honeysuckle blooming on our honeysuckle bushes behind the camera. The birds are singing. It's just a beautiful day, and it's a wonderful setting for us to get stretching and relaxed and to enjoy this full active recovery and rejuvenation day so that we can finish up the last two workouts tomorrow and Saturday together. All right? So we're going to do a little bit of longer dynamic stretching and warm up before we get into our deeper stretching today. And. Go ahead and start in a nice wide stance. So a wide straddle. I want you to reach high, reach out to me, reach back behind your heels, reach front, reach high, and just keep going just like that. Reach front, reach back, reach front, reach high. Just keep alternating there. We're gonna do a full minute. Keep your back nice and flat the whole time. Reach wide, reach back, reach wide, reach high, just like that. Reach, push those hips back. Just keep going. We have 20 more seconds of these. Ah, get a nice dynamic stretch going. Awesome work. Whew. Come on. Reach high, one more, reach out in front. Take your right arm, it's nice and straight, and we are just gonna do a straight arm torso twist. So, we're getting a great stretch through our chest here in the front of our shoulder as we open up, and through our back as we close it. And then, just twisting. There you go, getting a little bit warmer, opening up through the chest and shoulder. Same thing, other side. Take your left arm, make it nice and long, just twist it back and forth. <sighs> make sure you're standing up nice and tall, shoulders are back, abs are in. It has been really rainy here all week. And yesterday, after some heavy rain in the morning, the sun came out. The sun came up this morning. I don't know about you all. But the sun after a long period of rain just makes my soul happy. Okay, so go ahead. You're gonna drive your right knee up, balance. Open it up like you're opening a gate, close it, tap the foot down. Knee up, open, close, and down. Knee up, open it, close it, and down. So work in the balance and your hip mobility. Knee up. Open the gate, close the gate, and bring it down. Knee up, open the gate, close the gate. Oh, stand up tall, have really good balance. Same thing, other side, here we go. Knee up, open, close, and down. Knee up, open, close, and down. Nice. Good job. Knee up, open, close, and down. Knee up, open, close, and down. Oop. <laughs> Knee up, open, close, and down. Knee up, open, close, and down. Nice. So we're gonna take it to inchworms next. And when we go down, we're gonna go all the way to our bellies and you're gonna give me a Superman. So go down to your belly, extend the arms and legs up, push up, push your hips back, and walk it back. Come all the way up. Long legs, it's okay if your knees are slightly bent. Walk it down, nice and gentle. Lower yourself down, extend the arms and legs, squeeze the back, push yourself up, hips go back, walk yourself back. Stand all the way up, nice. So, building some heat. Waking up the muscles and joints, getting the blood flowing just a little bit in really good preparation of having some awesome stretching today. We're gonna get down into a glute bridge next. 
to warm up the glutes a little bit more. Because <laughs> we're going to be doing some stretching through the hips and glutes today. So, we are going to have our feet close together, right? So, as you come up, you kind of butterfly your legs open. As you drop the hips, the, the knees close. So, I call these butterfly glute bridges because your legs are like butterfly wings flapping. Feet are close together. Knees close as your hips drop. They open up as you push your hips open. Good. I'm looking up at a beautiful blue sky. There's a white cloud floating across <laughs> and it's all framed by the green, happy spring leaves coming onto the trees. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna roll over and get on all fours. We're gonna do some a bird dog variation to wake up the back just a little bit more. Take one arm out, one leg out. Lift, abduction, pull them away from midline, bring them in, tap them down. Lift straight up, open them, close them, and down. Lift, open, close, and down, good. Your thumb is up, you're flexing your foot, driving energy through your heel. Squeeze your back here and squeeze your abs to support your good posture and your back and to help you balance. Ready, switch to the other side, here we go. Balanced, lift, open and close, return, and down. Lift, open, return, and down. Lift, there you go. Focus on balancing and really controlling this motion. This motion. We're gonna do a low plank spider next. Lift, open, close, and down, lift. So get into your low plank and we're just gonna alternate bringing the knees nice and wide out towards your arms. Good. After this, we are gonna stand up again and we're gonna work our shoulder mobility with a shoulder dynamic stretch series. Good job, almost done with these spider planks. So stand up, okay. Take your arms out to a T. Bring them up, rotate the palms forward, cross them over, reach opposite hand to opposite shoulder behind you. Open them up again, rotate your palms behind, reach and cross them behind. Okay, you see how we're doing that? Rotate, the other arm goes on top that this time. Reach, rotate back, nice work. Just keep going just like that. Good. Nice. Good job, good job. Give me 15 more seconds of these. Working the shoulder mobility. Ah, that feels good. Okay, go ahead and get into your seated butterfly position. Soles of your feet together. Knees are open nice and wide. Draw your heels in towards your groin. And right now, just sit up nice and tall. Drop your head down, drop your head down, and look up. Drop your head down, and look up. Now, bring it to center and just look left and right. Just for 15 seconds here, and right. Sitting up nice and tall. Look center again. Now just drop your ear over, right ear over, left ear over, nice and gentle. Right ear over, left ear over. Good job. Okay, keep your legs right there. Take your right arm across. Give me a cross body rear deltoid stretch here. Opening up through your upper back. 
rear delt, squeeze it across, pull it across, sitting up nice and tall still. <sighs> Same thing, other arm, pull it across. Oh, don't let your shoulder shrug up into your ear. <sighs> nice. Now, pat yourself on the back. Let's stretch the triceps there. Oh. Mm. Just breathe. <sighs> Sitting up nice and tall. Keeping your knees open. Shake it out. Same thing, other side. Pat yourself on the back. Apply gentle pressure on the elbow there. Stretch through the back of your arm there and breathe. Oh, do you guys hear the happy little birds chirping? Okay, pull your knees in, press your knees down even more. Gentle pressure there. I like to use my elbows. <laughs> there you go. Just gentle pressure there. Push them down even more. And if you want, when we hear that beep, keeping a nice long spine, hinge forward. Oh, even more. Energy going out your head, nice neutral spine, shoulders down and back, and push your chest forward. Breathe. Hang in there when you feel your hips and lower back release. Sit forward even more. Push your head forward even more. Shoulders are back away from your ears. Lengthen through your spine and your neck. Push your chest and head forward. Awesome. So get into a mermaid. We'll have our right leg over our left. Okay? Just like this. And we're not sinking down. Push away. So what we're going to do, we're going to hinge over this way. Nice. Stretch, 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 stretch. That feels good. <sighs> and bring it up and hinge over this way. Oh. Open up through the side body there. Lengthen. Push your fingers out away. Actively stretch yourself. Don't roll forward, chest open and back over to this side. Reach over, lengthen, push your fingertips away from you. Pull your hips down, actively stretch your shoulders away from your hips. And don't sink down, push that bottom shoulder away from your ear. And one more time over here, actively lean over, reach the fingers over, again, pulling the fingers away from the hips, lengthening through your side body. <sighs> mm, that feels good. And go ahead and switch sides. Left leg over right leg. In your little mermaid. Ready? Lean over this way. Oh, lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. That feels good. Just breathe. Nice deep inhales and exhales. How long can you make your arm? Push your fingertips away from your hips. Bring it up. Lean over the other way. Oh. Beautiful. Reach, lean, come on. Actively stretch. Keep your chest open. Don't fold or round forward. And here we go again to the other side. Reach it over. And breathe. Bring it back the other way. Beautiful, reach, reach, reach. I feel
feel like that timer is up really loud. In this next little transition, I'm going to turn the volume down just a bit. <laughs> I hope it's not like messing with your zen there. <laughs> so, we are going to get into a half kneeling split. So, one knee down, the other leg out in front, flex your foot, hinge forward over it. Okay? So, pushing the hips back, leaning over that leg. Just realized my fake tan looks so funny. <laughs> That's all right, you forgive me, right? Now, same thing, just take that arm over, twist, fold forward and twist. Oh my goodness, sit your hips back even more if you can. That feels good. The neighborhood's waking up around here. I hear a saw going. <laughs> all right. Go back to the front, so square up, just straight down over. Can you sit even more into it? Shoulders are back, spine is long, hips go back, leg is long, flex your foot. Sit back into it a little bit more if you can. And let's twist, opposite hand over, twist as you lean over. Can you go deeper this time? Breathe. Here we go, let's set up for the other side. One knee bent, other leg down, toes up, leg nice and long, hinge forward, sit your hips back. Oh. Make adjustments as you need to, to feel, to make this feel right. But again, you should be slightly uncomfortable. There should be intensity in these stretches. You should feel it lengthening and take it over, twist as you fold. Holy. Breathe into it. As you feel your hips lower back and hamstrings release, sit even lower, twist even more. Back to the center, sit low. Can you make it an even better stretch, an even deeper stretch? Twist over, last time here, twist over. Mm. <sighs> okay, so sit into your straddle. Sit up nice and tall, straddle your legs. Okay, and we're going to bend over to the right. Ugh. Nice. Can you get to your forearm? Maybe you can get even further. <laughs> Just breathe and hold it. Do not collapse forward. Keep your chest open. Extend the arm out. And breathe. Nice and easy, same thing, over to the left. Keep that chest open, keep your hips down on the mat. We're gonna bring it to the center here. Reach even further, oh, lengthen, stretch, stretch, stretch. Bring it to the center. Hinge forward. Oh, nice. Amazing. Keep your shoulders back. Push your chest forward. Push your chest open. Spine is long. Breathe, breathe, breathe. So, stay in your straddle, kind of shake it out. Take this time, jimmy yourself open even more. Can you stretch into that straddle even more? OK? 
okay back over to the right we're going to repeat those stretches again oh lengthen trying to find that deeper stretch other side guys I'm just over here trying to be really present I'm paying attention to the sounds around me I'm feeling the breeze on my face wherever you are pay attention to what you're hearing hopefully you're enjoying the music that I'm put into the background here just breathe connect to your body how it's feeling Bring it up and let's go to the center. Push your chest open and out, lengthen through your spine, lengthen through your neck, hinge forward even more if you can. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Okay, walk yourself out of that. We are gonna do an even more intense <laughs> inner thigh stretch. So let me pause this. We're gonna do a little prone frogger position here. I'm gonna double up my mat and have it go this way for my knees. Cause I'm gonna be facing this way. So, you, are going to have your legs bent flex your feet and just open up right there like that okay forearms supported okay and then just rock back to your forearms rock your hips back and come up so the first little bit just rock it back and up rock it back and up feel the inner thighs and groin there Rock back and up. We're going to hold it back there in just a little bit. That straddle helped open up the inner thigh already, inner thighs already for us some. Okay, so sit your hips back into the frogger. Oh my gracious. I haven't done this one in a while. I forgot how intense this one feels. Hang in there. Can you sit the hips back even more? <sighs> All right, so here we go. We're gonna rock again. Rock it back, come up, rock it back, come up, rock those hips back, and come up. The wind's blowing, guys, and the little tiny rain droplets that are left on the trees are coming down. <laughs> it sounds like it's raining, but it's not. Oh, rock those hips down and up. Okay, sit back into it. Last 30 seconds of this and last 30 seconds of our stretch today. Embrace the intensity. Push those hips back. Breathe. Can you sit back even more? I don't know. <laughs> nice and easy. Gently come out of that. Takes a bit to come out of that, right? Oh, amazing work, everybody. Let me stand up here. Let's take a couple nice cleansing deep breaths okay so let me fix my shorts <laughs> give me a nice big inhale and exhale give me one more nice big inhale and exhale like I said amazing work thank you so much for taking the time to take care of your body with this stretching session today I hope you are going to be committed 
to wonderful, beautiful, healthy, nourishing nutrition today. Get your water, get your adequate protein, get your five fruits and vegetables, nourish your mind and your soul, get that journaling in, right? Connect to yourself, practice your mindfulness, and of course, comment below which stretch left you feeling the best when it was over. I want to know which stretch you enjoyed the most today. And until we meet again on Instagram later today or tomorrow for our full body strength and hypertrophy workout, I want you to always remember no excuses, no regret, just sweat. Bye everyone.